Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Ashley and today's video is going to be an extreme all day clean with me. As you guys can see, my house is so dirty. I really wanted to tidy it up, but not only that, I wanted to get some deep cleaning done. So we are going to be doing tons of dusting, deep cleaning, getting in all of those areas that are often overlooked. So if you guys are in some need for some serious motivation to get some deep cleaning done, then you came to the right place. So we are going to jump right into this video by first tackling the living room and dining room area. You stole my heart, what is it that you do? My life was great till you added colors. Like the moon needs the sun, we don't care about the others. I had gotten started on my cleaning a lot later than I typically do, so I had tons of things on my to-do list that I wanted to tackle, and of course, I like to wait until Ethan is taking a nap to get a good portion of it done. It just makes it a little bit easier. How about you guys? If you have a little one at home, do you find that you like to wait until they're sleeping to get your cleaning done? I will be honest with you guys, I have not moved those fireplace tools since we put them there two years ago. So it was so dusty and nasty down there. So I needed to clean that corner and the baseboard really good. I just wanna love you, just wanna hold you, just wanna be with you till we grow old. You tell me you'll stay or take me away. I want you for myself every single day. You set my world on fire. You set my world on fire. I just want you. I just need you I don't know what it is you do I just want you I just need you I don't know what it is you do I just wanna love you just wanna hold you just wanna be with you till we grow old just tell me you'll stay or take me away I want you for myself every single I have really been loving the Scentsy all-purpose spray. That's what I have in my Grove glass bottle. It is the Johnny Appleseed scent and it just smells amazing. I love the way it leaves my house smelling. Scentsy really does have the best smelling products. I can feel the wind blow And the late summer sky is like a giant
have been so obsessed with my homemade carpet freshener. All it is is baking soda and 20 drops of essential oil. I currently am using lavender and it leaves my house smelling so amazing. I don't think I will ever go back to store-bought carpet freshener because this one's scent is so much stronger and it just smells so good and I love knowing that it's all natural. Going all the way until November. If you guys noticed, Ethan is now awake from his nap and he had gotten his crackers on the couch. So I went ahead and put him in his high chair to finish eating and needed to scrub the couch after I vacuumed it. He is always getting stuff embedded into the sofa, but what I like to use on my couch is just a little bit of shout and a little water and just rub each area. Right here I'm using a microfiber cloth and it got it right out and I just love shout because I've never had an issue with it turning anything a different color like my carpet or furniture. So I always know that I can use that on something and it's not gonna mess up the coloring. Now we are heading into my bedroom to get some cleaning done. I knew that I wanted to deep clean this room because it was getting so dusty on our dressers. So first I needed to make our bed. I have been trying to get better at making my bed every day, but honestly, I don't make it every day, but it really does help start the day off right when I do make it. So I try to make it often. And as you guys can see, I had laundry piled up on the dresser, so I just had a lot to get done in our bedroom. Whenever I do laundry, I pull out my husband's shirts and hang them dry. So I've just been putting them off to the left side until they're dry and then I move them into his main area once they are nice and dry. I have recently gotten some new subscribers, so I just wanted to take a moment to tell you guys, thank you so much for hitting that subscribe button and joining my YouTube family. You guys honestly have no idea how much it means to me. YouTube is truly my passion and I am loving getting to know each and every one of you guys. So anytime you want to chat, drop me a comment. I always try to get back to every single one of you or you can DM me on my Instagram. I'm really active on there as well, but I just hope you guys know how much y'all really do mean to me. And I went ahead and opened up a PO box for you guys, just in case you wanted to send me a letter or anything you'd like to send me. But I just hope you guys know how much I truly love and appreciate every single one of you. And if you guys do want to send me anything, I will leave my PO box linked in the description below.
Now we are heading into my bathroom. It's mainly my side of the bathroom that needed some TLC. How many of you guys can relate that all of our beauty products just wind up on the countertop? I don't know. <laughs> There's no good excuse for it, but I just have so much. And then on top of Ethan digging into my cabinets, and as you can see, I have spray bottles with missing tops. It's just easier to leave them on the counter, but it was time for me to tackle this mess. And thankfully, as you guys will see in the video, on Monday, I finally got some more of the locks in the mail. So I finally have locks in my bathroom so he can no longer lose all the tops to my sprays because honestly, that has been driving me crazy. Every time I go to use a hair product, I have no spray top and I'm literally searching the house all over trying to find it. So problem has been solved. I really love those magnetic child locks. They are awesome and I love how easy they are to install. You know you're beautiful. I'll sing until my lungs give out your beautiful. I also wanted to tell you guys that the to-do list that I am using in this video is actually a free printable for you guys. So you can click the link and print you out one as well. And definitely if you have an Instagram and you end up using my to-do list, I would love for you to tag me. Let me know that you printed one out. It would really mean so much to me. And a huge shout out to my bestie Valerie Santos because she helped create this to-do list for me to share with you guys and I'm just super excited. So definitely let me know if you print one out and what you think about it. I wanna put you in that spotlight. Looking at you all night, all night. I'll sing until my lungs give out your beautiful. I have been neglecting my baseboards, so I have really been trying to make a point to hit them whenever I clean an area. So I'm definitely cleaning my baseboards a little bit more often. And as you can see, they are so dusty. So it definitely was good that I got that done.
And of course, it wouldn't be an all day clean with me without some laundry motivation. I am always backed up with laundry. It is never ending. So I'm just gonna go ahead and tackle this laundry, get it folded and picked up. Now that I got that folded and put away, I'm going to be tackling this laundry room. It was so dusty in there and I really wanted to get to the floors and get them clean because it had been a little while. I do keep my cat litter box in here so I try to clean the floors pretty frequently. So I needed to clean out the litter box and then pull everything out, get the floors cleaned, get the washer and dryer cleaned. If you guys notice the downy refresh, I believe the scent is rain or rainforest or something like that. But if you see that in your stores, definitely pick it up. I have found my new favorite. It leaves the clothes smelling amazing and for so long. I'm seriously obsessed. I couldn't believe I hadn't seen that scent before by Downy. They had it at Sam's Club, so I went ahead and picked it up for the first time, and now I am addicted, so definitely see if you can find some in your local stores because it left my clothes smelling so strong. If you like strong, then you will love that fabric bead. Mystery, I don't think I ever wanna go come closer next to me. Trying to find another way to say this, but I think, I think we were meant No need to rush, so let's just take our time. Dropping everything, cause you're stuck on my mind. My mind. So just sit with me, talking to the night until the morning, building camp mystery. I don't think I ever want to go come closer next. Another way to say this, but I think, I think we were meant to be. Oh, we were meant to be. Oh, we were meant to be. Oh, we were meant to be. So just sit. I have been meaning to ask my husband to pull out the washer and dryer for me because it is so dirty back there. I just keep forgetting to ask him to do it. So for now, I just vacuumed in between the cracks. But as you guys could see back there, I know there's socks and I'm sure there's other clothes that have fallen behind there. So that is on my to-do list very soon. I just have to remember to get him to move them out because I did try moving them the other day and there was no hope. I could not move them. So that's going to be on a future to-do list. Oh 
So I ended up saving the kitchen for last today because I really wanted to wake up to a nice clean kitchen and not have to worry about it getting dirty before nighttime and then having to clean it again. So I just laid Ethan down for bed. The girls have done their portion of the dishes. So now I'm gonna tidy up the kitchen, get the dishes put away and be done for the night so I can relax. Drinking red wine by an open fire Make love or fight This or that This or that Evening's on the train I'll catch a morning fly Enjoying dinner until midnight On bed by night This or This or This or that
love having a clean sink. So that is definitely my favorite part about cleaning the kitchen is getting my sink nice and shiny clean. So tonight I'm going in with some baking soda and my scrub brush and just giving it a really good cleaning, scrubbing all of the edges because I do get a lot of grime built up in there. So this really helps to get it out and to get all of any weird smells that you might have in your sink. So I definitely love using some baking soda, even putting a couple drops of essential oil down the sink definitely helps to give your kitchen a really good fresh smell. We are coming to the end of all of this cleaning motivation. I really hope it motivated you guys to get up and tackle something on your to-do list today. If it did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. It really does support my channel. And if you haven't yet, I would love if you would hit that subscribe button and join my YouTube family. I do upload every single Monday and Friday at 9 a.m. Central and often do bonus videos on Wednesdays. So be sure to have that notification bell on. And don't forget to check my description for that free printable. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye.